Okay, starting in three, two, one. Aloha, this is the Green Lining Mr. T. Last episode, we, um, saved someone's child life who was not there. And this episode, we shall take on this dungeon. I forget the name of this island, oh well. <laughs> it's nice that they all have names, though. That's something I didn't realize for a long time, that the, well, the towns have names, but all these areas have names. I've been noting, noticing that as I play. Like, proper desert, uh, Midoro Swamp. Is this that? Yes. We meet these guys. I have no idea what these things are, but they are annoying. So I like, the best way I like to deal with them is to downstab and use the jump. And that was bat poorly um, timed on my part. The well, it wasn't on my part, it was on his part, really. For him to die and etc, etc. And for some reason, these guys have more health. That's another thing. These, I don't really, these guys, I don't know. I can't really do these guys' health or anything. I don't have no idea. They look the same, I really don't know. So I was think, plan, thinking of restarting this area, but that's not, that's um, thanks to that guy dropping that magic, I think I'm going to keep going. And as you can see, my jump is actually down to 20 now, and it's almost like at the same level as shield is. It'll soon be below where shield is. And I think the life is going to stay where it is. I, I think the fairy might go down still though. Why did I get stuck in there? Oh well. Too many enemies on the screen for him to spawn more as I kill one let them spawn more. Okay. The ceiling is falling. And that seemed pretty boring. Anyways, what do we have here? I think there's... Well, there's a key under here, I mean, right? That's one thing that's certain. Oh, get under, get under, get under. Alright, this is... It's, it's a bit easier to take this guy out, because you can stay under here. Just don't let him fall down here, and you'll be fine. I hate those guys. Alright, point bag. Little you guy. Yeah, I started a new episode, that's right. Alright, let me take care of this guy once he's down here. Before I start to fight that darn up, even though that dark one is quite optional. And uh, I do mean to let him get down here before I. I. No. Got him. Alright. Now, by the way, when you, this is kind of like Mario when you're running, you get a higher jump. So, that's how you, so that's how you would get up here normally. Oh, good, I bounced. Didn't bounce there, though. Another dark note down here, which I want to face. Yes, just for the experience. There we are. Now I just need to get up this. That. Well, I can just do that. Make my life easier. And there we are. Right. 
there's a red one of these guys. Maybe he has more health, maybe not, I can't know. And this is annoying to get up. <laughs> wow, that was that was nice. <laughs> so what? We're outside. Didn't even get to swing a sword. So in this outer area, for some reason, they have included this, this dungeon. But we get a key that we need later on. So we can now head down here. Go right on this elevator, see what's going on. What's going on? Yeah, what's going on? Seriously. <laughs> Anyways, can... Oh no, 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 no. I hate these things. These little dog statues, I hate. I think they take away experience and they are infinitely spawning. I'm not moving on, am I? Okay, I think. Uh, do I have to go back? Please tell me I don't. I think I do. Maybe there's an item, or maybe there's like double keys or something I need. Although that wouldn't be the case, there can't be that. Because you would need. Then there, it would become impossible at some point. By the way, that glitch I was talking about a long time ago, um, you can fly through the keyholes as a fairy. Um, I don't think that was intended. It, it's what it. It's what eventually happened. But um. You can't. Oh, wait, nope. We're good, we're good. I think. I'm not sure about the elevator being there, though. I hate this. Just because of this one room, I hate these dogs so much. They always put these dogs in this room. I don't like these dogs. Okay, so I need to break through all this in order to the, get to that key, because going straight down will certainly lead to certain doom, and I have to play... Oh, you did not just spawn behind me. You... Ugh. I hate these things. Because they just keep firing. They're relentless. Don't spawn behind me! And th th this is the kind of thing they do. They spawn behind you. Why? That's not really fair. I can't block from both sides. <sighs> uh, just give me the key and I can leave. Right above the shield. Okay, I'm out of there. I took like half. They took my half my health from all that. Jeez. I don't know what my next level up is. If it's a sword again, I can't really remember. It, I, I, it might be my health this time. I don't know. If I could remember. I could plan these out better if I could remember, like, what was next upgrade. But, alas, I don't. So, do I head back right? I can't remember. Oh, is it? Is it? It's the raft in this dungeon. Oh, I do need to go that way. Okay. At least I think I do. Uh, I don't know. Whatever, I'll figure it out later. Although, I don't know if I want to face the boss anymore. That could go badly. Okay, just you. They put any of those blue guys in this room. Just throw their maces, ugh. Yep. I need to want this power thing anyways. Over here. 
you can't be that close to the edge of the screen, you're just gonna go off screen. There you go. There you go, keep coming, keep coming. Oh, that went well, thank you. I'm almost at my next level. And this is definitely the way to the boss. And guess what, guys? You get to see blue dark nuts. Everyone loves blue dark nuts. Everyone hates them. Don't let them know. Don't tell them that. All right, these guys will throw knives at you. At least what I think are knives. And you, and in this quarter, you kind of have to fight them the way you're supposed to fight them. But if you, remember how I said, like, they, they have a pattern? Like, if you hit them, they get angry, and they calm down after a while? This is where you need to take advantage of that. Now, there is a way to hit them, like, in their heads, right, right above the shield. But I don't remember how to do it. Off the top of my head. Yeah, I can't remember how to do it, so I'm just going to fight them normally. Ah, got me. I'm just trying to keep them away from me. And I think you do, bl you do block stuff even while you swing your sword, yeah. I think I got him twice there. Man, does he have a lot of health. Okay. And thank goodness for that, because it is life. Now, if I can remember what the boss is. Oh. Oh, if it's that boss. I'm so not dealing with this boss. I'll probably leave. Ooh. That's not a nice, that's not a friendly boss. Oh, you cannot hit me through this. This is not fair. Right, I'm gonna get on his better side. So that I have room. Alright, this is annoying to get out of. I don't even have a magic to use jump spell. They made it just barely possible to get out. Okay, this I'm definitely not fighting him now. This guy was not very cooperative. Ugh. Point back, I want that. Okay, I did it. I was I figured it out. Yeah. Barely enough time to swing your sword, but possible. Don't fall off my lap, little guy. This guy is practically like, sitting on my foot now. Because he just keeps sliding down and down. These cats have no sense of whether or not they're gonna fall or not. They don't really care, do they? Oh well. Boss. Definitely not in the condition to fight him, even now. 
There you go. I won't fall. Alright, so, glad everything went well on my trip over here. Kind of not so glad that I have to deal with that kind of boss. And this run going as it is, I may choose not to even come back here. Since I know this is the boss of the dungeon, and, I've, and I have to go back anyways for the item of the dungeon, I might as well just not come here. I'm better off probably coming back once I am all super leveled up and stuff, because I'm going to have to come back to this place anyways. Um... I really kind of want to head back to the star and grab that that uh, potion now. And wow, am I making that look really easy. As I say, as I make it look really easy. Ah, oh, here it is. go. There we go. Right. <sighs> I wonder how I'm gonna set up the I guess I'm gonna like include their experience, the amount of experience they get. Um, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not gonna do the health. I'm not gonna do the damage. Just features, name, and maybe experience points, and that probably be it. Quite the long dungeon. The elite go out the other way, isn't it? Because <laughs> I was right at the boss, and the exit was given. I was given another exit right there. Almost there. And I've picked up quite a bit of magic on the way, so I'll have a little extra going back into the dungeon. Because I think I, I kind of want to not leave. Although, if I leave, I could get all the experience again. Mm. It's a hard decision whether or not to leave the dungeon in order to refill all your stuff. And it's Game of the Dark Knight. I'm not gonna deal with that. I want my magic. I'm not gonna face the boss, so... It, well, I, it's still a lot of enemies. Oh, I really don't know. Alright, I think maybe I'll just leave. I should've waited on that. Well, it pay, didn't work out anyways. Okay, alright. In we go. Enemies are already back. I already know what I want to use in here. What the heck? I must have accidentally hit down there or something. Hmm. That went well. Oh, that it was worth it. The fact that I managed to kill that guy with relative ease makes means it's worth it. That's extra experience now that I get. And without taking the damage, of course. Well, I did use a little bit of magic up, but that's alright.
Okay. Just run through here and that's all I have to do in this room. This is a good room to grind in as well. Oh. Once you take out this guy, that is. For potions and stuff. Not for points, it's good for grinding for potions. That's a down, that went awful. Uh, great. Still has pretty decent stats. And I'll take care of you again. Come on down this time. Don't do what you did before. Ah. Oh. oh, great. Oh, nice. <sighs> Honestly. Oh, I can't hit. I, uh. Yeah, I just need to reset this room, basically. Oh, jeez. Oh, and he hit me! Oh. Oh, that was close. Dang it. Thank you. Oh, I forgot to reset my watch anyways. It looks like we're basically out of time. So, in the next episode, we shall continue to this dungeon. Not to face the boss, but just to get the item. Because it'll be easier to deal with the boss of this dungeon later. And with the strategy I have um, of getting all the one-ups, um, it won't matter that I have to deal with him. It. It'll be better. I won't get the experience from him, but he, he only gives a little bit of experience anyways. I, it's worth not dying to him. It's worth. It's worth it. So, at any rate, this is the Green Lightning Mist Lightning Mr. T. I hope you've enjoyed the video. And to you I say aloha. This is the Green Lightning Mr. T. Last episode, we started this dungeon and... Well, that, that, that's actually what all we did last time, right? And we discovered what the boss was. Well, I remembered what the boss was. I will not be dealing with him because of my strategy for not dying in this place. Okay. Now I'm coming over here just for the extra experience points. I don't, don't need to come over here. Is there another? Or is that? Yeah, that's it. Just a little uh, extra hundred. Alright, now I do have to go this way. I hate these dogs. Now here's a room where you, you don't have the option to skip because they block it off with these things, which you cannot destroy as a fairy. So, there's that. Actually fight one of these guys here. Here's the wall blocking you off. Alright, another hundred. Oh, blue one.
this is so much easier now that I can um, have lots of room. Because, as you see, before the space between us was so small that you kept running into me. Now we have room to fight. Although he takes forever to defeat anyways, because... Man, they're tough. This is actually what the boss would be, except it is a, it's a two-part fight. Okay, Raft, and this isn't the dungeon I was thinking of, but still, I'm not fighting the boss, which I believe is the Blue Dark Knight. I could be entirely wrong and run into him in the next dungeon and then shoot myself in the foot, but I, I think it's the Blue Dark Knight, which is reason enough for me not to face him. Plus the fact that um, I'd have to go deeper into the dungeon anyways, and look at my dreadful stats. No! 